In most organizations, when an employee leaves and a new employee joins, the IT administrator would actually want to completely wipe out the hard drive of the PC and re-image it with the corporate image so that the new user has a completely fresh PC with nothing left over from the previous user. Secure Drive facilitates that and provide with a capability called Secure Erase, which can easily allow for erasing of the hard drive. Let's go back to our Secure Drive management console and you will see the Secure Erase button. If the IT administrator clicks the Secure Erase button, he will be asked to provide an additional level of authorization and once that is provided, a signal will be sent to the client PC that will perform a cryptographic wipeout of all of the data on the hard drive. Every single byte on the hard drive will be erased, leaving the data completely unrecoverable. After this process is completed, the hard drive can easily be re-imaged with the corporate image to be used by the new employee. The secure erase functionality can also be used when a PC reaches its end of life and is being decommissioned for use in the organization. One of the challenges for organizations in today's world of regulations is tracking and auditing. Mandatory compliance regulations related to privacy and data breach, such as HIPAA, Sarbanes-Oxley, all require IT to be able to audit and track what user logged on to what PC and what time to ensure that only authorized logins to the PC have access to corporate data. Secure Drive facilitates the process by providing event logging capability that tracks every time a user unlocks the Opal hard drive and logs it into the PC. Let's go to our server screen again so we can demonstrate this functionality. If we go back to our user, Barack Obama, you will see that one of the tabs is for event logs. And if we click on the tab, we are given the option of specifying the server name on which we will log all of the activity from this user. In this case, we have specified this Active Directory server named Secure Drive. We also have an option that we can specify what in events for this user we actually want to audit and track. And in this case, we have set up to track the Windows logon. So now, if we bring the event viewer up, and we can expand the event logs and then we can see the different events that have been generated. If I select the most recent events you can see that it shows that Barack Obama logged on from the PC named Softex SD and it will also show the date and time at which the login event happened. Since this is stored in the standard Microsoft Event Viewer Third-party event management tools can easily extract and process the information to generate reports from these logs. As we said in the beginning, full disk encryption, whether done through a traditional software-based mechanism or through one of the new self-encrypting drives, is an absolute top priority for an organization. However, one of the limitations of any full disk encryption solution is that once a PC is unlocked, the data on that PC is vulnerable to attacks by hackers and malware while the computer is on. Even though every byte of data on the hard drive is encrypted, this vulnerability still exists. To mitigate this risk, Secure Drive provides a file and folder encryption capability which is complementary to the full disk encryption. The file and folder encryption can be used to encrypt individual files and folders of sensitive data on the PC so that even if a hacker or a piece of malware attacks that specific piece of data, it still will not be able to read the data unless the user authentication is provided. Let me demonstrate this functionality to you. On the desktop, we have a folder of data which has top secret reform plans for the president. If we open up that folder, we have two files, our jobs reform plan as well as the Wall Street reform plans. Clearly, we want to secure this data. So to secure this folder of data, we right click on it and select the Secure Drive Encrypt Files and Folder option. And now we will be prompted to provide an authentication. 
And in this scenario, we can select to use a fingerprint. So in this scenario, we have selected to use a fingerprint swipe as the method of authentication. Now I swipe my finger, and it recognizes my finger, and then proceeds to encrypt my files and folders, and it even changes the icon on the desktop to a folder with a lock on it. If I want to access that data, I have to double click on the folder that, I just, that was just created. And I must provide authentication again, in this case my fingerprint. And once I have done that, I can view the data inside of that folder. If I click on the file, it will automatically open up and allow me to edit that data. One of the nice features of the Secure Drive File and Folder encryption capability is that you can share these sensitive pieces of data with other users in the enterprise. So I can right click on the folder one more time and I can select the Secure Drive Sharing option. And now I have to authenticate once again. And once that is done, a dialog box comes up where I can go ahead and share other users to have access to the file. And in this case, I will go ahead and authorize Joe Biden to also have access to this data. Once I have added Joe Biden, now I can actually take this encrypted folder of data and email it to the other authorized users, and they can use their authentication, whether it be fingerprint or smart card or password, to access the encrypted data in the folder. One of the other challenges with full disk encryption software is the ability for an enterprise to apply software updates, software installations, and patch management on client PCs that are running full disk encryption solutions. This is due to the fact that an organization will use a management console like Microsoft System Center and Configuration Manager, Landesk, Alteris, or any other application like that to remotely deploy and install the software and patches, typically at night when the users are not using their PC. If the users are not present on those PCs, and if the PC needs to be rebooted as part of the installation process, the process will be stalled, waiting for the end users to type in their unlock passwords. To work around this problem, Softex has partnered with Intel to utilize the Intel Active Management Technology, or AMT, which is present in the chipsets of the Intel vPro processors to remotely power on and provide unlocking credentials to the client PC that needs to be rebooted remotely. I'm going to show you now how this feature works. If we go to our management console, we can bring up our Secure Drive AMT application. Now we can provide the remote IP address, and the remote AMT password as along with the secure drive username and the secure drive password that is required to unlock the PC. Now once we click the button to unlock the PC, the PC is remotely powered on if it is in the powered off state. And once the Secure Drive PBA logon screen appears, we will automatically fill in the Windows credentials for the user and unlock the PC so that the original Windows operating system can be booted up. Now that this power on and unlocking process can be automated with the use of the Intel Active Management technology, an enterprise can seamlessly deploy their software upgrade and installations and patches without any end user intervention. Secure Drive is a comprehensive data protection solution based on open industry standards. To summarize our demo today, some of the key features of the Softex Secure Drive data protection solution are the following. Easy deployment, configuration, and management of Opal-based self-encrypting drives. Enterprise class centralized management for IT administration. Support for remote, out-of-band management features of the new 2010 Intel Core vPro technology. 
A secure pre-boot authentication and, uh, environment with single sign-on to the Windows desktop. Strong authentication in the PBA environment using biometrics, smart cards, and multi-factor login. Secure file and folder encryption. Secure erase capability for drive redeployment or PC end of life. Emergency logon and recovery capability of credentials and lost passwords. And finally, strong auditing and tracking capability for regulatory compliance. I would like to thank you very much for your time today. For more information on the Softex Secure Drive solution, please visit www.softexinc.com slash product slash secure drive. For sales inquiries, please email sales at softexinc.com or call area code 512-452-8836 to speak to one of our sales representatives. Thank you once again for your time today. Mm -hmm.